Well, oh, hello. Good evening. I do truly, truly hate that sign. Right there. And also, seem to have really poor timing today. <laughs> uh, I was hoping there'd be a clear spot up there, but there's not. So, gonna have to kind of figure something out here. So, what Argo has done, yes. Argo the Wonder Dog. Aren't you, Argo? He's shy now. Anyway, what he's done is he found us Arthurim Anderson, which you can just see peeking over the American Legion there. And our timing was horrible because I didn't quite get off work early enough. Well, I got off at five, but I wasn't early enough to get down to catch them by the Valley Camp or the George Kent Marina. But I wasn't slow enough <laughs> to catch them closer to the lock. So I'm catching them right here with all of these obstructions. And they are in no rush for a couple reasons. One, okay, but probably just one reason <laughs> is that uh, they have to wait a while for the lock. The H. Lee White was just pulling into the lock as we were walking by. And uh, so they have to wait, wait for that lock. So they have a solid, you know, 20 minutes plus lift for them to leave then for them to cycle the lock back so you know they have almost an hour wait so i didn't look to see if there's a down boundary waiting so if they do then it could be even more than an hour so why they're making a uh, a gentle approach <laughs> to the landing here yeah i'm a little jealous of these People walk in there. Because Argo is not allowed in the US Army Corps of Engineers property. Yes. As they say, it is what it is. I'm going to pan over here really quick. We will pay our respects to Spud up there. Keep an eye on everything like he does. He's a good spud. I'll say I'm glad, of course, for the lack of bugs <laughs> here in the Sioux. As I've probably mentioned in my previous video, so I'll just mention it again. I uh, spent a good part of Memorial Day weekend out in the woods and the mosquitoes are hungry as is tradition. So I treat all my clothes, my hiking clothes with permethrin and Argo is treated. So we, we got out with uh, not donating too much blood. I know they did get some. Those vampire, <clears throat> yeah, <laughs> we'll uh, <laughs> keep it family friendly here. I'd like to get them here in that opening. Let's put eyes on her. The uh, John G. Munson came through this morning another favorite ship. And then I was busy through most of the workday, so I didn't have opportunity to watch. Argo's doing his uh, 
flop and wiggle on the ground behind me right now. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear him snorting. Historic Arthur M. Anderson. As you might just a touch, you can see there looks to be some uh, kind of serious looking clouds over there across the river. I don't think we have anything in the forecast though for today. Maybe late tonight. I have to look. Did I mention? I don't know if I meant today's Tuesday. Tuesday the 28th of May. Now, yesterday was Memorial Day here in the United States. And today was well, back to work day. Which the employers love, but the employees boo. <laughs> think we will be able to see anything. As far as the deckhands going overboard. Well, maybe you can kind of see the arm there. I always like to comment on the Streamtime live chat that they're fishing with some big bait. And you can see the person with the life jacket on. Oh, stepping up. They're going to do it right behind the crane, aren't they? Yeah, right behind the crane. I'm going to take just a few more steps forward here. Catch the second one. Right behind the spud. <laughs> My poor timing continues. College students just walked by. You can always tell by the obscene amount of Axe body spray. can't see it, but Argo has me thoroughly twisted up, completely wrapped around my legs. Gonna about do it. I'm gonna go finish up this walk. Oh, in 
he got himself twisted up too. There we go. Now you ready? He's been waiting on me. So, all right. Well, I had to check out the Arthur M. Anderson whenever they're in town, and I have the uh, the time. <laughs> One of those must-see ships. So, it's a well-built shift. Well, that's a shift. Well-built ship. There we go. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go finish up this walk. You ready, Argo? I don't know, maybe he knows something. You see that hustle in his ears? Hmm, maybe there's another ship. If so, we'll be back. <laughs> anyway, bye for now.